Hudson <laughs> Stadium is mid-sized in terms of capacity. Its capacity for decibel level virtually unmatched. Like when Kenny Wheaton took back the pick. Legends like Mariota and LaMichael ran wild. Welcome to Eugene and Austin Stadium, home of the Oregon Ducks. We have a ranked versus unranked battle coming up here. You know how chaos can ensue if they start smelling an upset. As we'll see a squad from the Big Ten, the Illinois Fighting Illini, taking on the number one team in the land, the Oregon Ducks. For EA Sports College Football, I'm Reese Davis, David Pollock, and Jesse Palmer with me. Shut your s I am the night. I am vengeance. I am ball hawk, man. What's good with y'all? Hello. Hello. I need to go ahead and shut up and focus on the commentary. They got us in a hurry up offense. I'm out here. Mr. Don't touch my shit, please. And thank you. I'm out here lurking. I jumped the water. That's what I do. And guess what? I pointed that boy to let him know there's nothing you can do once I'm in open space. Touchdown. Another touchdown on this illustrious freshman year that our boy Vito Supreme is having. One for the ages. One that's going to get this boy a Heisman. I don't know who the last Heisman was to win at the middle linebacker position if it ever was. It had to be in like the fucking 50s or 60s or fucking 40s. But it looks like we about to do that this year. I'm going to go ahead and throw up the O. Too bad they don't know. I'm about to go to Ohio. Oh, shit, your boy just freestyling off the top of the dome. It's crazy out here. We back on defense. I want more excitement. Hopefully, I can jump another route. If not, man, hopefully, I can just make sound tackles. Keep the team that we're going up against. Illinois, not even a team in our fucking bracket as far as what our talent level is. But you never know because we are playing on Heisman. And whenever you're playing on Heisman, the difficulty of the other team is extremely higher. Doesn't matter if it's a sorry team like the SPS teams, whatever they call it, the fucking Division II generic ass teams. Whoever you're going up against, they will play like Alabama, like Ohio, like Clemson, like Florida State. I kid you fucking not. Doesn't matter who you go up against. If you're playing on Heisman, it's going to be a tough game for you. It is 10 to 7 by way of Oregon. And we are in Oregon, matter of fact. I feel like we should have home field advantage, but that means absolutely nothing because these boys are still moving. These boys still got life. I would think that even with one quarter passing, we should be up by 30. I'm going to keep it real with you. But the only way that's going to happen is if we're playing on rookie. I'm going to just keep it up. Buck Feedy with y'all. I'm going to just keep that shit 110% real with y'all. The only way you're going to dog a team is if you're playing on one of those lower levels. If you're playing on Heisman, it's going to be a close game as I get in there with the hit stick. But guess what? These boys are not fumbling the football. And that's also something to do with the difficulty level. If you play on a earlier or a lower difficulty level, you will get those fumbles. I guarantee you. And I'm out here trying to get after him, but I don't have the angle. So he's able to get the first down and a little bit more. They're within the red zone looking to take the lead. They got our fans looking very sad. Damn. But I'm going to go ahead and play man. I'm on him. When he goes to the other side, pause it if you need to. Because I said I was on him. But it didn't matter because they went to the other side of the field. And there was nothing your boy could do about that. It is 14 to 17. Of course, our offense is going to do what it do. They're going to go down and get their points, too. And I'm going to go ahead and hit him with a hit stick. But my teammate gets in and hits him from behind. Pause. And it negates my hit stick. It's crazy how you can just pause so much shit whenever you're speaking about sports in general. It's crazy. We live in a crazy time. Crazy society where our brains go to the most unethical shit. Yep. Anyway, man, I get a little nudge, and it keeps me from running full speed. You already know how that goes if you've been playing on Heisman. If they touch you even the smallest, you are out of the play. It's been like that since Madden 23, and they're not going to change it. It's going to be just like that in Madden 25. So go ahead and buckle up and get your mind right. As they go deep, and it's a catch because we're playing zone. And you already know, as soon as they get their hands on the football, it is a caught pass. Doesn't matter if you hit them as soon as they get the ball. 
at the apex, it is not going to be a drop ball. They take me out for a bunch of series and look at the score, 23 to 28. Every time they take me out the game, shit like this happens. Leave me in the fucking game. That's why I'm leaving. Y'all thought I was joking about the Ohio shit. The little Ohio run I gave y'all a couple minutes earlier. Y'all thought I was lying. I'm going to Ohio next year, man. Fuck this team. I'm out here lurking, trying to see if he's going to make the same mistake he made in the beginning of the game, but he doesn't because our defense get in there and get the sack. Give us the ball back. Let's see if we can attack and get this score back on track. You know, I be freestyling, bro. Y'all can't, can't lie, bro. Your boy be freestyling. I'm a freestyler extraordinaire, bro. Stop the cap. All this shit is a freestyle. I'm coming off the top of the dome when I be giving y'all these commentary videos. It's nothing but freestyle for your boy. I'm all off the top. Nothing written, bro. So when y'all hear them little bars I be giving y'all, just know your boy built like that. Actually, your boy built like a deep freeze out of this bitch because I need to lay off the motherfucking Chipotle out this motherfucker. You feel me? Hell no. But we back here playing zone. I'm trying to bait him a little bit. He decides not to come my way because he knows, pause it if you need to. He knows I'm out here lurking and I'm trying to bait him to throw it to someone near me. But on this play right here, he throws it just out of reach over the top of my head. Nothing I can do. He knew he wanted to go to the dump vial, but I was there, and they get into the backfield to get the quarterback down. I was right there. I knew he wanted to go to the little safety vial, but he didn't go that way. He decided to eat the... I don't want to say it, bro. I don't want to say it. He decided to... I don't even want to say it that way either, man. He just took the tackle in the backfield because that shit is wild, diabolical. If I were to say he takes the sack or he took the sack or he ate the sack, all that shit could be paused. Anyway, I'm out here lurking. He doesn't come to my side of the field with the football, and he goes to the opposite side. It's all G, but we are only up by a touchdown. They can easily go down and score. I'm trying to give a little space because I wanted him to go to the guy that was coming in and around. He does not come my way. Pause it if you need to with the football. Instead, it is a turnover. It ain't even a turnover. They just take me out the game. They just took me out the game. I was thinking there was turnover on downs. But they just took me out the game. It's all G though. It is 34 to, oh, I'm sorry, 43 to 36. They're only down by seven points. That means all they have to do is score. And they can be over with. And I jumped around. I thought they were going to move down the field. I showboat a little bit. And it could have cost me the fucking game. It could have cost me the fucking fumble. That's two picks, two fucking TDs on the game. I told y'all I'm a master baiter. Pause it if you need to. I'm a master lurker. Lurk God in this bitch. Even though y'all like to say it's because I got a 99 overall. I know some of y'all have a 99 overall and y'all ain't playing no Heisman. Y'all have a tough time getting picks, man. I be getting picks. It does not matter if you're 99 overall. I got a couple 99 overalls in the background that don't even be getting in the way of them passing lanes, bro. I be, I be doing this, bro. I do this shit for real. I do this shit for real. Like two games straight, I didn't get an inter I didn't. I got an interception last game. I ain't gonna lie. I got an interception last game. I did not get a touchdown last game. And then the game before that, I didn't get a pick at all. I just got a half of a sack. I'm telling y'all, just because you a 99 overall don't mean that you're going to get interceptions and take the shit to the crib. You really got to have a little bit of skills with the 99 overall. You got to be able to read the defense and bait the correct way. Just saying, man. But anyway, man, let's take a look at the stats. This is your boy stat for the game. I told y'all I'm leaving after this year. But I don't even matter. If you're new here, this is what you should do here. Definitely subscribe. Drink your water. I love y'all. Fuck with the squad. Fuck with the squad. Fuck with us. <laughs> Fuck with us. <laughs> Fuck with us. <laughs>